search, and at the time of that article, there was 42,000 self-proclaimed network marketing gurus, ninjas, masters, rock stars, consultants, and trainers on YouTube. Now, granted, most of those accounts are dormant, and people did that, quality, good people that should have known better just from a common sense standpoint. And then about six months after drinking the Kool-Aid, they wake up and think, oh, my gosh, I've been doing this six months. I don't have anybody. Uh, all my friends and relatives and everybody around me thinks I'm an idiot, you know, because I've been talking about this stuff and I've never done anything, but I'm calling myself your number one consultant in Arizona or whatever. And it's like they wake up and they quit the industry never to return again. 27 percenters, good people that could have really done something significant if they weren't brought into this culture that makes absolutely zero sense. Attraction marketing may work for about 3% of the population, if that, if that, and that's if you enter the industry with an abnormal amount of personality, looks, or some other something that attracts people to watch your videos instead of watching their normal cat videos that they watch every day on YouTube.